What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Firestarter, from the World Famous Vertical Joes, representing for the Torque Technicians today. And listen, we are all gathered here today for one reason, body, okay? If you're like me, my entire timeline has been full of people posting videos, doing the body choreography from Megan Thee Stallion and Mr. Jaquel Knight. And let me tell you, I promise you, I just learned the choreography just from watching everyone else's videos and it looked like they're having such a good time. But I did notice that some of my people that I encouraged to join the challenge said they're having a hard time learning the choreo and learning the twerks. So you know, here at Twerk Technicians, that's what we are here for, to help the world twerk better. So we are going to give you guidance, okay, and the torques that you're going to need for you to nail this body routine, okay? So first things first, you know, grab your all black. For me, I got on this cute scully top from VJ Fashion Inc. You can get yours. Link in the bio while the supplies last. Got my nails by Miss Candy Press. All right, I got this cute harness on from Glory LA, and everything else I just grabbed you know, out of the drawer. So I had this little bra top, I had some drawers, some fishnets, grab some sneakers, all right? You need to look the part to get the moves, okay? Boom, all right? So with that said, let's go ahead and get started with the torques you're gonna need to body this body choreography. And no, I can only guide you. It's not my choreography. I can only guide you on what you need, but I at least can help you perfect these torques, all right? So let's get started. The first move that is going to help you body the body choreography is called the shoulders, okay? So at Twerk Technicians, we have a thing called Twerk Styles where we explore twerk from say New Orleans or like dance hall or African dance, okay? So the shoulders is a New Orleans based move, okay? So it starts with the shoulders, okay? So I'm rolling my shoulders back. Okay, one at a time, quickly. Cause you know, Nala's music be damn fast as hell, right? Like so. And then my hips are moving around a circle in a wine. Okay, I put it together and I got the shoulders. Yep, looks like so. It's just like beat it up, 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 beat it up. Yes, <laughs> all right, so. If you look at the initial move in the body routine, it kind of looks like the shoulders, except instead of doing the wine with the hips, it looks like they're just doing like a funky chicken with the feet. And surely you can handle that. So first things first, get your shoulders gathered. Second thing, get your funky chicken gathered, just one foot at a time. Knees are going in and out, and then you put them together and you straighten your arms. Look, you're probably doing it right now. Hey, boom, 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 boom. Yes, okay? So that's the first things first you're gonna need, all right? So clearly you start here, and you're keeping this footwork going, and then all they did really was add in arms. Ha. Yes? All right. So if you got the shoulders, trust me, you got the very first move of the body choreo, and that's half the battle. Because if you come in killing that, it's only going up from there. Okay, so give yourself a hand. Okay? Boom. All right. Next thing you're gonna need to body the body choreography from Megan the Stallion. Move number two is gonna be the drill team, okay? So the drill team comes from like, you know, HBCUs, like the dancing girls, the girls will be in the stand, get to it, you know what I'm saying? These girls, yeah, all right? The style kind of looks similar to that. So you need to be able to nail the drill team. So on the drill team, generally, we're gonna take a wide squat, with the shoulders lined up over the hips. The arms are gonna go up nice and straight. The hips are gonna thrust forward. And you know in twerk, we rarely thrust forward. This requires a thrusting forward, okay? Your arms stay straight and they press forward too, okay? So play around with this move. Hit it from the side, bah, center, gosh, gosh, gosh. Even putting a little jump into it, Woo, bah, bah. 
Let's take a look from the side. All right. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Okay. Let's look from the back. Yeah. 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 Okay. All right. So this is the drill team. And if you have a good drill team, it's probably going to be a little bit easier for you to do the next set of moves. Okay. So think about this concept of the thrust and the cadence of the jump and thrust. Okay. That's going to help you with the next portion of the choreo where she has something more along the lines of here, here, or around, yeah. Then she goes high, yeah, high, yeah. Ha, uh, ha, uh, ha, uh. okay? All of that is drill team relative. As long as you can keep the body popping and thrusting, all you gotta do is get those arms together and you win it, okay? So don't say, I didn't love on you, okay? Because the drill team is a thing, okay? So give yourself a hand because now you have nailed the drill team, okay? I hope you're keeping up so far, all right? So here we go. Next up, one of my personal favorites is the double dutch. But here's the thing, when I watched the video, I wasn't really sure if they were doing the double dutch or if they're doing a rodeo. You know, twerk technicians, we got nine, nine ways to twerk. Actually, we got more than nine, nine ways to twerk. And I wasn't really sure which twerk they were doing. So I'm gonna show you both. And that way you can make an informed decision, okay? So the next twerk that you are going to need to body the body choreography by Megan Thee Stallion and Jaquel Knight is gonna be either the drill team or the rodeo. So let's get into it. So the drill team can be a little bit tricky. The drill team looks like you twerking while you're about to jump into a double dutch rope. So it looks like this. Or it can be multiple hits. Either way, it's a rock with a hip drop, okay? So sometimes this is gonna take a little bit of practice. So let's talk about just hip dropping first, all right? So this is my right leg. I'm gonna prop my right leg up, pop my right hip up and drop it down. Drop it down so hard that my booty jiggle a little bit. Gosh, ga, 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 ga. Now I'm gonna keep the same energy, put my heel down. Bop, 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 bop. And to make it drill team, I'm gonna lean this way and then that way while I do the hip drops. Ga, 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 ga. Or lean for two and then come back for two. Ba, 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 ba. Okay? Ha. Drill team take a little bit of energy. Okay, so I hope you're living your best life in a drill team. Now, I'm not sure if they were actually doing the drill team or not. Some of the girls look drill teamy, and then some of the girls looked rodeo -y. So let's talk about the rodeo. The rodeo generally has a little bit of footwork, okay? The footwork looks like you're gonna go in a little gallop. So it looks like this, okay? Your hips are moving around in a wine. So you gotta decide if you like the wine to the right or if you like the wine to the left, okay? Now, if you're not sure about whining, you need to make sure that you catch a 99 ways of twerk class so you can get your basics together because the wine is one of those basics that you need in your life. I digress, okay? So here we go with the wine. So you put the wine and this giddy up type footwork together and you got a rodeo, okay? So it looks like they were doing the rodeo hips without the rodeo feet, which will put you here. Hey, okay? So not sure which situation it is, but when you turn around, you gotta shake that ass, okay? That's the point, all right? So, ah, oh. either decide if you're gonna rodeo or if you're gonna drill team, all right? Try it with me, pick which one you're gonna do, all right? Five, six, seven, eight, ah, ha, 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 okay? All right, so give yourself a big hand. You have nailed the double dutch or the rodeo ale, or maybe both, okay? All right, so let's take a quick recap so far, okay? The initial move that we used was the shoulders. That's gonna help us with the first portion of the choreo, where she is here, yeah, and then hands go wop, wop, up, ga, up, a. Yes, 
Then we went to the drill team, which is going to help us with the second portion of the choreography, which is here, here, around. God, get it. Yes, get it. God, that whole situation right there. God, God. Okay? Then you'll be facing the back, and it'll be time for you to either double dutch or rodeo. Okay? All right. Now, remember, I'm not here to drill the choreography with you. You're on your own with that. I'm here to perfect these twerks. Okay? So... You got all that? You got your life? Okay, I'm gonna add on because this is one of my personal favorites, all right? So next up is gonna be the stiff leg, okay? So for the stiff leg, you wanna think about arching your back as much as you can and then tucking your hips under without bending your knees. So it puts us here. Hey, get to it, 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 yes? Puts you here. God, 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 God. Great thing about the stiff leg is if you get a good stiff leg, it means that you also probably got a good chance to clap your booty, okay? Because a stiff leg is a good base for the booty clap. So it looks like this. Ooh. Oh, I just get a little, little applause. Not much, not much today, okay? So if you have a good stiff leg, you already are killing the next move, okay? So... The fine ass ladies in this video had one arm up, one arm down, and they killed us with a stiff leg. Yes, so all you gotta do is get your bounce on with the stiff leg and then smack your foot down and take a little hop, okay? If you can do that, you definitely can nail this routine, okay? So that is pretty much like the bulk of like the hook and for the most part, most of the people that I've seen on my timeline have been doing these moves. So again, you got the shoulders, okay, which for us looks like this, all right? In the body video, looking like this, okay? Next move is a drill team, which for us generally looks like this. The body choreo has some different arms, but it's still the same concept, okay? Then we have the double dutch or the rodeo, where I'm not sure if they're leaning or not, or if they're moving in a circle. Don't really know. You're going to have to take that risk and see. Okay. And then we have the lovely stiff leg, a little bit of a hop in there. Okay. So listen, if you got all that, I'm telling you, you got this routine. You're going to kill it. You're going to nail it. All right. So now, I just wanted to give you guys a, a couple of other gems that you may need that are sprinkled up and through that amazing video that you can use in your life as you get your twerk on, okay? So first thing is gonna be the heel drops, okay? So I know you saw the heel drops in there. It's one of the most like popular parts, right? And the way they shot it, like all the jigglish, like it was amazing. So for the heel drops, you're gonna need the soft shaker. The soft shaker is when your butt shakes down in your squatted position, okay? So the squatted position should have your shoulders over your knees instead of your hips, so you end up being here and your butt shakes down. Yes? Now for the heel drops, all you do is drop one heel down at a time, okay? So if you put that with the soft shaker, you already win, okay? So if you notice in one portion of the video, they had the heel drops going. Yeah, they also had some salt shakers going. They jumped up, which we call a toss it. Yeah, that was winning and that looked real sexy. And you notice um, they also stylized the heel drops a bit more because you saw them do like a step, step on the beat, which is still utilizing the heel drops. Okay. Next thing, y'all, the shimmy, one of our personal favorites. One of our basic moves, there's lots of shimmying in the video. If you haven't done the shimmy, the shimmy means your legs are straight, your shoulders are lined up over your hips, you'll tip your booty over, and you're going to wag your hips from side to side, like you got a tail, and you want to wag your tail. So it looks like this, okay? Ah. Ha, ha. Now, if you're like me, I don't got no hips, right? So if you don't have hips, you got to twist your hips a lot more, Yeah? That way you really, really get a good bit of jiggle into your shimmy, okay? My ladies who got the hourglass shape, you ain't got to work as hard because you got, you got, you know, you got the, that ass you can see from the front, you know what I'm saying? So you ain't got them kind of props, all right? But that's the shimmy. Lastly, 
You know, Megan Thee Stallion can't give us a video without giving us something that is going to torment bad knees, okay? So this move we call the pee pop, all right? So the pee pop is done in squat position. The shoulders are relaxed. And the pee pop really is a game of the knees going in and out, which is why I think it's Megan's like signature move is clearly she got knees of steel, okay? When you're here, I'm just balanced on my the ball of my feet, but is... Definitely working, but it's not like thrusting intentionally. My knees is going in and out, and that's what's helping me nail this twerk. So I'm more here. And you notice this is where they were slapping, slapping booties, uh, living their best life, okay? Like so. Ooh. God. God. Yes? Huh. All right, y'all. So don't say I ain't never gave you nothing because I've given you the shoulders. I've given you the drill team. I've given you the double dutch or the rodeo. I've given you the stiff leg. I've given you the heel drops. I gave you a little sprinkle of a toss it, salt shaker, shimmy pee pop, all the things. Do not say that the torque technicians did not love on you. All I ask, all I ask is that when you body this routine, that you tag us at the Turk Technicians so that we can, you know, comment, put all the smiles and all the emojis and let, and let us know that we were able to, you know, help you, okay? I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you catch us for a few things. We have Turk classes online. Of course, because, you know, it's COVID right now. We have twerk classes online for all levels, okay? For those of you who love a good twerk, we have twerk every month or sometimes every other month. We twerk for three hours with three different instructors. For those of you who are professional twerkers, we have the Twerk Technicians Master, um, sorry, the Twerk Technicians Certification Program, okay? And that's where we have a four-hour course that also has two hours of self-study where you get certified to teach twerk worldwide okay and for those of you who are alpha certified or nasm certified we got those credits for you all right from taking our amazing course so that's it y'all i want to see some booties shaking okay i want to see you body this body choreography okay so make sure you catch uh catch us online go to uh, the link in our bio get one of these cute shirts um oh you like, you know, you like my hair today. Uh, I can get a link for that. I can get a link for one of these right here. Little, little Bob wig winning. You know what I'm saying? I love it. So lots. It's giving me life. Okay. So listen, that's it. Okay. Get to twerking. I want to see how everything turns out. Make sure you tag us. Thank you so much for watching. And y'all make sure y'all body this routine. Okay.